Loved ones of a well-known tour guide walked the streets of the French Quarter tonight to remember her. This was a bar crawl in honor of Christy Thibodeau. She was killed one week ago in an attempted armed robbery. Since then, three teenagers have been arrested in her murder. Good evening and thank you for watching. I'm Devin Bartolotta in for Whitney Miller. Before tonight's walk, a bar in the quarter held a fundraiser to benefit Thibodeau's family. As Winston Reed shows us, her friends remember her as the caring person who loved to introduce newcomers to the city's nightlife. Family and friends look back on the memories of Christy Thibodeau, sharing stories and drinks that will benefit her upcoming funeral. The owner and, uh, and, and bartenders have generously uh, decided to donate all of the profits from uh, the benefit uh, to her family for, uh, for funeral costs. Um, and that includes all of the bartender tips. Well, everything that, that comes across the bar is going to be donated to, to the family. Brian Kane was a friend of Thibodeau. He owns Crawl, a tour guide company which the late hospitality professional worked for. Heavy hearts today. You know, no one deserves to you know, leave this world that way. Um, just completely, un you know, unsuspected and, you know, not, not the person that deserved it. So, yeah, we're, you know, we're all hurting. 19-year-old Joshua Bonifacio, 17-year-old Jabon Alberic, and a 15-year-old are all charged in Thibodeau's murder. According to police documents, Bonifacio and Alberic admitted to being involved in a robbery spree in the French Quarter. They told police that the 15-year-old fatally shot Thibodeau while she was sitting in her car on the 700 block of St. Peter's Street. Thibodeau died at the scene. We're also angry, you know. It's, uh, she didn't deserve this, and uh, th this juveniles committing crimes like this is a regular occurrence in New Orleans now. So, um, yeah, it's, it's heartbreaking. As Thibodeau's family deals with her tragic death, her work family hopes Sunday night's fundraiser will help ease the stress moving forward. You know, no one expects this to happen, and, uh, you know, it's just unforeseen expenses that we want to make sure the family's taken care of. In New Orleans, Winston Reed, WWL, Louisiana. Thibodeau's death happened at a violent time for the French Quarter. On the same day she was killed, two people were shot and survived on Bourbon Street. A week earlier, a man was shot and killed at that same intersection on Bourbon. Thibodeau will be laid to rest this Wednesday.